I'm Megan, and he's back. We're here with Mark Montano. Hi. How are you? Hey guys, how are you? That's Mark right. Sandwich, people. We suckered him in again. Yeah. <laughs> and he's back with his big ass book of crafts. And today we're going to make an urban corsage. Yes, mm -hmm. an urban corsage. D they so look fantastic on you guys. I know, I told him when he put how it on me, fun. I felt like we were going to the prom. A little bit, <laughs> little yeah. Bit. So tell me what we're going to do here. Well, you know, I mean, I think the emphasis these days is on recycling and repurposing, right? Yes, so definitely. it's really important that I know all of all of my friends who are crafters, and I'm sure you do, have this big pile of scraps laying you that you you cannot part, you can't part with the scraps. No, it doesn't matter how big, how small. She you saved so this. Many. I've gone to t cutting little pieces of cardboard and wrapping my little scraps around. Them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know, you have awesome. to save the scraps. They're important. <laughs> so, so Sorry. I thought. It's like a Tourette's. I say pack rat. Sorry, go ahead. She, continue. I know she is. I know. I know you call your mother a pack rat. So what I did was I started saving all these little pieces of things that I had and just keeping them in this bag. And I'm like, I am going to do something with these one day. And I don't know. About eight years ago, I was thought, let me make a cool wrist corsage, something really oh, fun. Throw a flower on it with all the scraps, and that's what I've done. And I called yes. it the urban corsage because. There's nothing really terribly refined about it other than it's just hodgepodgey yeah. and really sort of hip. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's very hip. He Look can at, say, how come he can say hip? Um, she will not ever let me say that word. If you give me a minute, I'll come up with a good excuse. Okay, I'm sorry. Go but ahead. look, see how hip you look? <laughs> I, you're so hip. so hip. Do you know what you're doing here? Now all day she's gonna be like, well, Mark said I was I'm hip. hip. I'm like, great, wonderful, <laughs> I'm in for it now. So, you know, sometimes you have maybe like five inches of lace left from a project. You have a couple of buttons that are mismatched that you can't use. Mm -hmm. You know, I bought all these fake flowers. I always have faux flowers, just, just bunches of stuff just it's hanging stuff, around. Right. Like, you know, five extra gemstones from a bedazzling project or, or when you get a button card you use three buttons and there's one left right exactly what well, are you, gonna, you can't throw it away the urban corsage is there the perfect answer go. now the great thing about this is you can sew if you want to you will definitely have to sew on a button but there is an alternative to the button and that is the velcro dot oh well, okay okay so it can either be a sew project or a no sew project she'll do so i'll do no sew I'm not okay. getting her on the sewing machine yet. But the really fun thing is, okay, you know that, that I only use two glues in my whole life. Mm -hmm. E6000 or Goop glue, anything from Eclectic, this kind of stuff. Right. Or, or Elmer's glue for, like my, e for my paper projects. Right, right. Yes. So this is an E6000 project. Basically, if you don't want to sew, you can, you can just glue everything together and so it works perfectly. E6000 works on fabric too. So I've always used it for my Does. Baby. I've always used it for beading. Does E6000 work on fabric? <laughs> Dumb on. Anna. Oh, I've always used it just for my beading project. Nope, it works on everything. Oh. Yes. It doesn't work on, on your fingers. I made sure before we started this project that I could not glue my fingers together. Well, now I've got a new fabric glue. You absolutely have a new I'm fabric excited. glue. Use use it in moderation because you don't have to use tons of it. Yeah. That's the thing. And don't make any mistakes because once that thing <laughs> yes. is together, it Good is stuff. not coming off. Okay. All right, you have to start. But that's the great thing about scraps. So here we go. Um, we We're gonna make. This? Look at this. We're gonna make Megan do this because she uh, professes to not be crafty, and so. Your nerves are starting. I feel them. Hand all right. The book, honey. So you have some room to work. All right. Thank you. This is really simple. There's all different. Uh, just for examples, look at that. Buttons, gems, leaves left over from a, from a, silk flower. I love really simple, bookies. right? Yeah, they're fun. Oh, that's pretty. And yeah, just what, and just some little oh, little just appliques. Whatever's oh, left fun. over. Whatever's left over. And the more hodgepodgey, the cooler it looks. Mm -hmm. And it matches every outfit. Yeah. Okay. So here, I've actually sewn this one. Okay. Um, and we'll need to sew a button on it later, but you know, why don't you This is your sample. Come on, oh, you come can on, handle you this. Can this darling. I know you you can. can totally handle this. Is okay. so easy. Do I do the center one? I feel like I should probably do it. Do you want to do it all with this. glue? Should yeah, I ever do it with all glue? Yeah, I'll do it all with glue. Yeah. You're yeah. You, look at you, troublemaker here. Oh, you yeah, me. I see what you. Uh huh. <laughs> Someone else understands. I get it. My mom's the same way. Oh. Don't even. Yeah. Okay. So now all I right. Gotta, I gotta glue all these. Yeah, you're just gonna glue it all together, and you know, don't just use the glue. Don't be afraid of glue. I'm so afraid. Here's your sample. What do you? I, just, I always glue my hands together. Get, like I'm not person. Use this. I'm not All right. person in emergency room. Okay. No, 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 no. So put this. This is our first layer. Okay. Really simple. Do I do like four dabs? Just go. Oh, just like, line, light, like a lightly line, around the. Yeah. Like a little line, honey. Oops. Listen to mom. 
Is this really your daughter? I told you. We're gonna have to speed this up. It'll be fast forwarded. Like we'll be talking like, and she'll be like, <laughs> all right, easy enough. See, look at that, Megan. It's like third grade all over again. It's a very bad year for me. <laughs> you relived it a couple of times, huh? <laughs> yeah, do you think We're you not going to tell anyone. You the glue a little faster this time. Okay, okay here I go. Right. Watch. And look at how beautifully that sticks. Yeah, you don't even see it either. It's perfect. Glue at super speed. Yep, or just use the glue. Because the edge, honey, a little higher up. Because this glue is not going anywhere. And you know the other thing about this? Once this, once this sets, it's washable. Yes, that's the that's what people don't know about this because it no, turns into like a. This. I've used this for years and years and never knew. Washable. That. Smooch, smooch. Yeah, make her do the smooch. Unless her get glue on her hair. Isn't that beautiful though? It is. It's give you really glue nice. and. And doesn't it? Gloss. And it and it it's not going anywhere. That's the cool thing about it too. Here, I'm gonna just. We're gonna have to yeah, get her. You need a new tube for her. Maybe. <laughs> She's overused the glue a little now, bit. Now, how cool is that? I like it. Super easy, right? Let's put the, okay, let's put the leaves on. Okay. Do you have to line this one? Yeah, go around the edges if you could. Here, this one's open too. See, I'm getting the hang of it now. You, you really are. Where do I put it? Like, right there. Here's our sample. Because it's the petals on the, the flower, honey. Little scraps, you know, these are the tiny little scraps of glue. Look, you got glue on it. And I see you use pinking shears around the edges. Yes. You just paint it so there's no fraying. I'm going to do this really quick because you already got to do one. <laughs> Real speed. And I, hate, and I hate to have people crafting in front of me when I can't craft. Especially when they're doing it. Makes me really nervous. <laughs> but we're talking to you, you can just rip the fabric if you just want to rip it and Oh, yeah, I use pinking shears. Yeah. But the cool thing about an urban corsage is that right. it looks urban, hip, right. yeah. you know, city-like. Now, how cool is that? It looks great. Cool. It's not going anywhere. Can you glue those on? Um, very good, right in the middle. Now, let me see. Did I bring, I think I have Velcro here somewhere. Is that the center? Yep, that's it. It is now. Where did she come from? I, I she is the fruit of your loins, and she, she, she's, afraid of, she's afraid of glue. <laughs> I, she's getting better though. That's it's a good thing she's beautiful on camera. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop it. Go on. Stop. No, please. No, she, she, she automatically tucked it under. Yeah, I'm, I'm following the sample. I know, but you're like, you got it. Mark didn't tuck his. All right, let's put these on really quick. I'm going to do a little sample. Come on, Megan, grab the buttons and help them out and get those glued on there. Oh. Can you do that? Can you handle? I don't know. I know you can. I now, what Mark's talking three. about is instead of doing buttons, we would put Velcro on um, the cuff and just glue the Velcro on the back, and then you're ready to go. So it literally is a no-sew project, and you don't have to. Um, so, but if you wanted to put the faux buttons on the top and just glue them on so it looked like you had buttons on the Velcro, would be great, Absolutely. Too. So just let this dry for about, you know, 45 minutes, and you're ready to go. Put a little that Velcro super on it. That is cool. Isn't it cool? And look. I just think it's so hip. No. <laughs> Nice try. Isn't though. it hip? <laughs> nice try. I, you too, I swear. I love when you say the word hip. Will you say that for the rest of the day? Yes, so you know what? I'll come, I'll come get you later. Super cute. Urban corsage. I love it. Yay. Well, thank you really so simple. much. It's and my what, pleasure. What do we say when creativity knocks? Oh, open the door. It's so hip. Yeah, open the door. Anna. <laughs>